In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how we can just use MATLAB based system that will be integrated to Raspberry Pi for home automation. First of all, after opening the MATLAB, I'll go to add ons. In that get add ons. After opening the get add ons, I'll just type here Raspberry. There are lots of uh, packages are there. So I'll just find MATLAB support package for Raspberry Pi hardware. In this, instead of manage, here it will be install option. But I have already installed this. So here I can just manage to show you. After going in manage, it will open a window. Here it is a package for hardware system. Here I will just go to setup and it this window will pop up, which is a hardware setup. Here I can use my Raspberry Pi model, which I'm being utilized for a home automation system. So I'll just use Raspberry Pi 3B and I'll do just next. And here it is just asking whether you are using a customized or already, which is available with MathWorks. So I will use already available. I will do next and I will download this file. It, it will redirect to a, a Chrome or some browser, which we are using and it will, this file will get downloaded. After downloading, we'll just do next and just uh, redirect, uh, browse our file which we have downloaded and just validate this. After this, we need to insert our SD card so that this file would be downloaded in that SD card so that that SD card will be inserted in Raspberry Pi so that it can operate with integrated with our MATLAB software. Now I'll jump to the MATLAB, how I made home automation system using MATLAB Raspberry Pi. So this is code for home automation system. First I will do show pins my Pi. So this is my Raspberry Pi 3B plus and these are all the pins and I can just select which pin I want to use. Starting from the IP, defining the IP address for the Raspberry Pi. After that, defining the input pins and the output pins, I will use the for loop. In for loop, I have used the for loop up to 20, 1 to 20, because I want to take only 20 readings. In which I'm just defining that a digital pin, if it will read, if my sensor in IR sensor will read that motion is detected, it will switch on the light. And when it will read, the motion is undetected. So it will switch off the light after some interval. Because when someone will be going to washroom or someone will be entering the room, the light will be automatically switched off while it will be detected by the IR sensor. And when he is out, the light will automatically switch off. So it is basically a smart home automation system. Let's see with the help of example. Here I have used a relay module and a Raspberry Pi which is connected to my bulb and IR sensor is being integrated with our Raspberry Pi. So I will switch on this and I will just start my model. I can see that this is motion undetected, undetected. When I will just put my hand it is motion detected and the bulb will on and wait for 5 seconds. After that again I will just switch, put my hand, it is motion detected. It will wait for 5 seconds and then it will switch off because my hand is removed. Again I will try, the same thing will happen. So actually this is what a battery which is connected to relay for giving external 5 volt supply and this Raspberry Pi which is actually I have connected this with my laptop so that I can supply this Raspberry Pi system. 